So hello guys, welcome again. We are uh, here with the Lord boy and I just uh, decided to let him allow me pass by Baraka's place because the other time that I, I came here to do a uh, solar installation, he was not with me. So I asked him because we have other errands to run, I asked him if he could uh, find time we pass by Baraka's place and say hi so he's here you can say hi before we continue yes so hi guys uh, welcome to zach discoveries channel so guys it is a, a pleasure time to be here and uh, last time uh, zach came here but uh, because of some activities uh, uh, it forced us uh, it forced uh, me to uh, to be on the other side at mama felistas and mama fred so that uh, we try to minimize time. So he came, and uh, some people maybe or I thought that maybe there's something going on, but I want just to assure you that uh, uh, I'm the one who told him to go, to, to come and uh, perform that because of time, uh, be, because of time that the time was late and we had rain. So I went to other place to do a video, and he came here to do a video. So today I'm grateful, and uh, I have witnessed what he did here, Actually, it is a marvelous job, as you can see. Uh, uh, the guy was uh, struggling to sometimes even to do si assignments and to study because of light. But right now, I thank God, uh, one of the subscriber, I decided to stand up with them and uh, I provide a donated for what you are seeing here. So mine is just to thank you and uh, to, uh, uh, to advise uh, uh, somebody who made this thing, uh, this good work to happen that uh, he works hard in school uh, because now the world uh, the world has watched him and uh, the world has decided that uh, they will stand with him in whichever matter so i like that and i'm grateful because that shows that uh, our charity is going very well uh, it is transparency and it is uh, honesty mm -hmm. so thank you very much and that's what i can say from me yeah thank you fellow yeah. but maybe to clarify him yeah yeah, so the installation of the solar yes. was uh, out of my own will. Eh? Oh, I'm sorry. For, I'm yeah. sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean. Yeah, so when I came here the other time when I was bringing for Baraka, this is the Baraka. Yeah. I hope you remember him. The one, yeah. who, here the, the one who was crying that day. Yes, yeah, the guy who issues, cried. Huh? So when I came here to bring him the item that I had bought him, yeah. the shoes, the uniform and so forth, uh, inside here you could not even take a video. Oh, it was dark. It was evening. In yeah. fact, we could not even see anybody here and remember our color. Yeah. So I thought it wise that uh, what if I, with the small that I have, that we, we installed this paper solar. So I went and looked at the lady, they looked for the lady from Sun King, the one that installed at Mama Felista. We came here, she did a good job. You can see the bulb there. There's another on this side toward the window. The, the battery is still, in fact, is functioning. By now, they have checked this full. Yeah. They are charging their phones. Yes. So, we did that, by, by the way, and it was a marvelous job. So, after that, that is when now they, our viewers, some of them commented, even some of them called me. One of them was asking, in fact, two have asked about the, the solar. How much is it yeah. in total if it's in paid total, in full? Yeah. Yeah. So, I, I told them, huh? So, in fact, uh, as I was saying, two of the subscribers have asked me how much is the solar if it's paid in full. Oh. So, I told them. By the way, there's that paper that we wrote. Uh, actually, bring because I'll send to the people who asked about that. Uh, yeah. It is 16,000, I think. It is, is it 16,608 or 508? Let them bring. So, they asked about that. So, in case uh, someone is touched and would like to pay, we are welcome. Oh. But now, let me tell you why I brought you here today. You know, this boy, as I, uh, we went to the Baraka to purchase uniform. Yes. I noticed he was the boy that was talked about in the newspaper, in the television. Oh, and, this is the guy? Yeah, this is the guy. So oh, he's called Julia. Julius. Julius. It's yeah. Julius. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can just sit. You'll get yeah. it when we're done. So I was shocked that I was standing with uh, an international student. A top cream yeah. boy in the country. Yeah. So he had uh, performed. He performed very well countrywide. Eh? Country. He was the second in Kenya in that national exam. 
So as we were celebrating as Koreans, we have got a very bright, but I didn't know that one day I'll meet him. So I decided today I want to come know a little bit about him. Eh? Yeah. A little bit about his story. Yes, yes. Yeah, so in fact, one time I had him speaking in radio and I was told, I, ha I had people saying that that boy has very good confidence. Even the local radio we have at Kehanja, yeah. he went there and he spoke very well. So maybe, maybe we go to him. Eh? That is what I wanted to know, maybe a little bit about him. Wow. So I don't know whether I'll come close. No, you were speaking to me that time, but I never knew. Uh, he's the boy. The he's the boy. I have now seen. Yes, he's the boy. Yes. Maybe I come close. So young man, yes. yeah, the top cream boy. <laughs> Hello. Mm. You are seated with the, the best, second best performer in Kenya. Some years to come, he'll be the most. Famous. By the way, he will tell us what he want to be. Eh? Maybe we start with the, his introduction. Is that your brother? Yeah. Maybe we start from him, because as he continue reading, now we shall continue with you. Yes. My name is Juma Magige. Juma Magige. And I'm, ha and I'm happy for what you have done for us. All right. Yes. You're welcome. You, you, are, you are in uh, which, which class? I'm in grade 7. Grade 7. Yes. Oh, that is the J, C, J? JSS. JSS. Junior Secondary School. school. The new system. Yeah. Where, where, which school? Yamaraga Primary. Yamaraga Primary. Yes. So you are the brother to to Julius. Yes. Wonderful. So, how do you feel having a, a brother that uh, was the second best in Kenya? I'm feeling happy. Happy. Yes. So when he was announced as the second, and you, you saw him in the newspaper, do you have that newspaper around? Yes. Or you have thrown it? I have it. You have it. Yes. You have the newspaper that your brother was. The picture was there. Yes. Oh. So you maybe you'll bring, eh? yes. so you feel happy having uh, the best brother that can perform in the nation. Yes. Yes. So you should also work harder eh? yes. because he has set an example. So you don't have any reason for not performing because your brother has shown you the way. So the, whatever problem you went through, he also went through. Or he used to live somewhere else when he was studying. Mm. The same house. Eh? Yes. And from the same house, he became number two in Kenya. Yes. Isn't it? Yes. So you have no reason. You have to make your mother proud, eh? Yes. So as you get us the newspaper, maybe you go back now to our... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So we go back to Julius. Julius, yes. now tell us your full name. Mm -hmm. uh, my name is Julius Chachanipo. Mm -hmm. uh, I am the second out of the seven. Out of, of the seven. Oh, there are seven. Yeah. So, so where is the other one? Uh, the other one is not around because he cannot afford here. So he's just trying to find at least what he can uh -huh. just to so you mean your mother has seven children yeah my friend so how many so far have we seen so far we have baraka we have mary we have who and the two boys there's this brother of yours the other one the and you yeah. so where are the two so, there's another boy yeah there's another boy and there's another guy oh somewhere else yeah oh yeah. so you see these rooms are too small uh -huh. and they cannot afford all the, uh, accommodate all of us all right so the mother had to do something else uh -huh. uh, so that at least there is a room mm -hmm. for breathing however it is just it is just uh, still too too minute for us uh, all right yeah so the room yeah. but that is a small room to to accommodate seven yeah it's very small very small and it's a rental so Julius, how old are you? Someone by there asked, how old is that Julius? I am 16. Six, exactly. In fact, she said you are 16 years. Yeah. 16 years. Yeah. She's still young. She looks young. Very young. She looks young. Yeah. Uh -huh. You are in 16. Yeah. So tell us a little bit about your background. So tell us about your father. Because we learned that your father and your mother... They divorced. Eh? Yeah. See, they divorced or their father is not there? They separated. They separated. Yeah. Oh, they, not, they just separated. So, does your father take care of you? No, of course. He doesn't even call to know how they cheated. Yeah. Even after you performed very well in the country. Yeah. Oh. Ah, man. He's not taking responsibility. Some men need to be arrested. Actually, they will be arrested. Some men need, they will be arrested some men need to... How? Because uh, how can you uh, fail to take responsibility to your son? And uh, you know very well that uh, 
uh, is supposed to get education yeah accommodation and shelter uh, everything that uh, uh, a child should need the parents should be responsible to that we are sorry for that mm. but uh, it's unfortunate that because me as a parent mm. I would feel very happy when my son perform or my daughter. That's good. That's you know he has uh, he or she has made made you proud. Eh? Yeah. Because uh, through that, uh, mm. uh, you have been known mm. countrywide. Yeah. Like this, like okay. Let us read an example like this. Uh, my uh, my brother here. Uh. Uh, he made some people, some prominent people, to know uh, maybe her mom. Yeah, uh, yeah. And to know maybe some places where he comes from. And you see now it has uh, uh, through that. Uh, is uh, how he performed and yeah. that's why he's here and that's why you as a, 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 a somebody like a good samaritan yeah can, you just uh, also watch that story mm. uh, and uh, you try to find out uh, right now that uh, uh, now i watch that story on the tv and on the newspaper yeah uh, should i now look for uh, this guy uh, at least i uh, i see if i can be able to meet him uh, so that he can be able to interview. But God has now directed you to this place. Yeah. I can see that. So Baraka was pulling me. Yeah. I can say that, say that uh, for you reaching here. It's through Baraka. It's through Baraka uh, and through and, God's and grace. Through God's grace. Yeah. That's what I can say. Wow. Yeah. So you have made me be known, man. Yeah, you have been known yeah. because of the story. Uh -huh. uh, okay, highlighting the such story. Yeah. You know, the, uh, the boy, he has been known and also you. So they, they are congratulating you because... Uh, uh, through you, mm -hmm. we can use that through you. Yeah, uh, he has been helped. Huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, maybe uh, if you could be okay. If what about if you could be new this story? You knew this story uh, that uh, he's staying in a pathetic life like this one. Then you you be quiet with it. You don't want to maybe highlight it. You know maybe God uh, could be telling you that uh, there's something that you knew and. You, you never, do not want to talk about. Never highlighted it. You mm. never talked it about. Mm. So some things like this, some church like this. Uh, more so, more so in terms of education, mm. uh, we must be very seriously mm. uh, to consider that because you see, education is the key, yeah. the success to succeed in life. And uh, if we have, uh, for example, there is an uh, a way, uh, like you now, mm. you have helped him in yeah, terms of education. Yeah. Who knows? Maybe one day, one time, uh, he will help. He will help your daughter, your daughter or yeah. your son. Because uh, people stay in this world, and uh, you never know when you, where you will meet. Yeah. So that's what I can say, and that's what, how why how we are operating this charity. Good. Yeah. That's fellow the boy. Yes. By the way, he's called fellow the boy. Yeah. He's a big yeah, on man. Social media. Yeah. On YouTube channel. I'm fellow the boy, but my name is Felix Mokabo. Mm. So yeah. let's go back to your story. Yeah. So you are telling, but is I'm not happy with that part of your father because your father should be part of you. And uh, meaning, if the father and the mother could not have separated, you could be at your place. Yeah, and true. the joy of that's performing true. well could have gone maybe to your village. So, sorry for that, but uh, we wish him well because God has your plans. Now, tell us about your education because the last information I have is that uh, you schooled in a very good uh, private school. What happened? How did you, how was your mother coping because... Uh, with this life, I don't think that fee in that school your mother can afford. Tell okay. us. Okay, first of all, mm. uh, it is a process because immediately the mother uh, separated with the father. Mm. It happened that the father chased the, my mother mm. and uh, he sold all the land that we used to live in yeah. and disappeared to the neighboring uh, country, that all is right. Tanzania. Thank you. Right. Thank you. Mm. So... You see, we could not afford, we could not live at a, a person's uh, place, yeah. so we had to evacuate. It's true. Uh, by that moment now, uh, they happened to be a good Samaritan who gave us uh, his house. Yeah. So we used to live there, mm -hmm. you see, but I could not now school. Mm -hmm. uh, my mother did not sit back because she said, I must search for a way. Yeah. I've seen so many kids struggling in life. Mm -hmm. And uh, they emerged to be winners. So mm. let me try. Yeah. So she went to that school that I was schooling, that is Momokoro Academy, mm -hmm. and uh, seek for permission for me to be there. All right. But uh, she put a pledge of bringing Skumawiki, That's which cute. could not even be enough for the school yeah, fees. Not even uh, enough for 10 people. Uh, so you can see how she was determined. However, 
for your education. It could not, yeah, it could not actually fit. So, on seeing that... Uh, so, she used to farm where? Uh, just around the house. The house that you are... Uh, wow. Yeah, yeah. So... Okay. So, we went uh, with her to the school. Mm-hmm. And uh, for the first time, you see, I was not schooling. Mm-hmm. And uh, I did not do that better. Mm-hmm. But for the second time, because now I had uh, acclimatized with the environment. Environment. Yeah, so I did better. All right. And for the third time, uh, continuously... I emerged to be the winner. So wow. The, the director saw the, my potentiality mm-hmm. and said, because of that now, I see I can just give him a, a scholarship if he promises to. That is the owner of the school. Yeah. Do you, do you know his name? Yeah. He's called Tobias. Tobias. Yeah. Can you hear that, fellow? Tobias. With his performance, the owner of the school, the CEO of the school decided to give him a scholarship. So that's, this that that's uh, for education. Yes, that the meaning these scholarships have been following you since primary. Yeah. Wow. So now that is when now you fully fit fit in the system. Yeah. You started huh? Yeah. So that was in which uh, class? That is in uh, class four. Class four. Class four yeah. Wow. So you schooled from class four all the way to class eight. Yeah. Free of charge. Yeah, free of charge. Uniform, food, everything. Everything. Now see the challenge was that. Uh, when it came to these petty petty things like uh-huh. uh, bathing soap uh-huh. and those and some they, small shopping uh, the teachers did not uh, sit back mm-hmm. because sometimes when we open the school i will not uh, report yeah so they had to tell me just come whatever the case we will just accommodate you may so, them that's good uh, of them i would go they give me that small things that i needed yeah and i would also share with the others mm-hmm. so that's how I found myself in class 8, did my KCP, and uh, the Lord did not also maybe forget you. Uh, forget me. So he gave me the marks that he gave me, that's 429 out of, out of 500. 500 marks, where the first guys uh, had 431 marks. So a difference of two marks. Yeah. Two a difference of two marks. A difference of two marks. So you are going to be the best. Mm-hmm. Men, we thank God for that. But before you say that, uh, this owner of the school, this Tobias and the teachers, man, you should not forget them. There are those people that will forget life, but there are those people that you should not. I wish you had some people like that. The country could have developed very, in terms of education. Very. Actually. And does he do this scholarship to other pupils or it was only you? Oh, also to other kids. Uh-huh. However, not kids like me who have maybe a parent, uh-huh. if not parents, uh-huh. only does it maybe to those who are uh, orphan okay. uh, and those who maybe their identity is not defined uh-huh. because they find themselves seeking for assistance in the school. All right. So he was doing uh, about 75, 73 to 76, uh, just giving them sponsors. In that school? Yeah. Hey. That's a private school. Someone is like a Two classes. He's sponsoring two classes in a school. Yeah. That man, that's a big number. Yeah. And we are saying we cannot manage. So that man will be blessed. So that's how you manage to find yourself in Momokoro, a big school. But eh, for our viewers, for our subscribers that are watching, Momokoro Junior Academy is a big private school here in Korea that is performing very well nationally. And you see now in last year's exam, they, they produced the second. Out of this guy's potential, the owner of the school saw that he could do better and he gave him a scholarship. So that's how he got that scholarship from primary school. Now, <clears throat> that is the primary part. When you are in school, in that primary school, life is good, right? Because you're having a scholarship. So when you come back here, life goes back to normal. Actually, it is not want even to be coming home. Mm-hmm. However, they say east or west home. Is home is best. best. Yeah. yeah. So the reason being, uh, at home we could not find maybe that good time to study. Yeah. Because I, I had to be faced with some challenges. Mm-hmm. And there was noise everywhere. Yeah. I could not study. Yeah. Uh, apart from that. Uh, food also was a problem. Mm-hmm. Apart from food, you see, there is a sleeping area. However, in school, you sleep alone. You see, you have that bed of your own. Mm-hmm. Sleep. 
but at home now I have to struggle down with mosquitoes and all that mm -hmm. you see the pain he was uh, passing through yeah but now because I had to assist my mother I will just come home uh, maybe yeah. assist in the banana selling and the charcoal selling yeah. so you mean by the way when you sleep because your mother said that uh, you put some mats down here mm. so so you remove the table yeah. and the chairs you put mats so the boys sleep here and the girls sleep inside. Yeah. So what happen, happened with the mosquitoes? Where do you put the nets? There is nowhere to put the nets. So you have you have grown resistant to mosquito bite. Yeah, you have to persevere. <laughs> oh my goodness. You can hear that, Felix. Eh? Yeah. They they sleep down here and they don't put any nets. No wonder. No wonder no wonder they don't have mosquito nets. They don't have mosquito nets. Because they say there's a time they could close school and they feel like he should not come home because in school, he has been given a bed with a, a, a mosquito net. Now he want to come back to the party with God. So here you are, Julius. You went from Momokoro, as you have said. You got that scholarship. You were at the scholarship in primary. Boom! You produced good grades. You went to secondary school. The school you are learning is called? Kapsabet Boys. Kapsabet Boys. It's another best school in Kenya. In fact, one thing about that school, guys, is that our president... Is a former boy in that school. Even vice president. Even the vice president. Even Moy, the, the, the late. Yeah. The leaders of this country. The second president of Kenya yeah. also schooled. So that is a school of leaders. Yeah. So you went to a school of leaders. Yeah. Your scholarship took you there. So I heard that you got a scholarship with Equita when I spoke with your mother last time. Yeah. So what does that scholarship offer? Okay, first of all, see, they were just speaking... Uh, one 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 person per sub county. Mm -hmm. You can imagine how many we were more than three hundred, but I just penetrated it is because of God. That's because of God. Yeah. So it provides everything mm -hmm. that that includes maybe for learning materials. Yeah. Only uh, anything that you need at school, maybe you can get mm -hmm. if it is a uh, exercise books, textbooks. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They pay everything. Now, when it comes to home, mm -hmm. because that, that is not now school, mm -hmm. however much I have the resources like the books, mm -hmm. uh, the few that you are given by the school, mm -hmm. I am faced by challenges maybe of writing uh, the table. I cannot find a good table. Sometimes I have to squat and uh, write. So this table, because I can see it is reaching near your knee. Yeah. So it is low. Yeah, what you are saying, it is very low. Yeah. Also, the chairs, uh, these are not the chairs maybe for studying. Yeah. Yeah, so that is a challenge that I'm faced with. Uh, mm -hmm. Also, food, because we are many and mm -hmm. this, uh, we don't have anywhere to maybe to cultivate. Yeah. The mother has to struggle, to struggle and struggle for food. So how many, how many meals do you have in a day? Actually, maybe two. Maybe two. Yeah. In a day. Yeah. So if you have porridge in the morning... Yeah, after supper. You, you wait for the evening, huh? Yeah. So we have a problem with the t reading table, yeah. the chairs, and we also have a problem with food. Yeah. Now, there was a problem with the lighting system, but God uh, has done something. Yeah. And I'm praying that uh, I will manage to finish that payment, huh? Yeah. So, apart from that, do you have any other challenge? Because I asked about the scholarship, what is of it? It offers everything. Now you have brought us up to home that the challenges you go through. Is there another challenge? Because is this room enough for you? Okay. Of course, we understand that basic ones are uh, universal. Mm. And I can say that I am faced with uh, these things. Mm. However much I have education, I cannot walk naked maybe. Yeah. You can see the cloth that I'm putting on mm -hmm. is a tracksuit yeah. for school. Yeah. So this is school tracksuit. Yeah, school tracksuit. So meaning you are you are using it both school and here. Yeah. Man. Because, yeah, I am ch uh, uh, challenged with yeah. that. Right. The mother cannot afford on food. And also shed uh, giving clothes. Yeah. So you see, it will be biased if he, uh, she buys me one and leaves the other one. All right. So All right. she just leaves us uh, to struggle that way. Uh, Maybe one of you can answer that call. You can give your brother to answer that call. Mm -hmm. Yeah, on uh, that is food, uh, shelter, and uh, clothing. Clothing. Huh? 
I have a challenge. Mm-hmm. And so with the shelter, All shelter. Right. You see, according to a tribe, mm-hmm. you cannot sleep in the same house with your mother. Very true. Uh, and I'm a big boy, you see, mm, I cannot, I cannot, that is uh, not functional. In fact, it's so not. That means that, uh, okay, when it takes to a certain age, yeah. uh, it's not supposed to sleep with the parents in the same house. Mm. So, that means that when you're a boy, okay, you can sleep with the, the parents, but when you're still uh, small, but uh, I think uh, when you reach around, uh, okay, in short, you can say that when you have been circumcised, you are supposed to be sleeping have, in a different you have house. You move uh, uh, from your parents' house mm-hmm. and own your house. Have your own. Even okay, you can build it for yourself if you are your parents, but uh, or parents can build it for you. Yeah, you know, long time ago they used to build using the local materials. Yeah. But nowadays you see, you claim they don't have the land. They don't even have anywhere to cut trees. Yeah. So that's why they're here. In fact, all these boys, these boys are need, need their room. Eh? This yes. they need because they're big enough. So that's another challenge. Yeah. Man. Guys, there's a... You can interview someone and you feel like... Uh, if you had something to do something, you would have done it immediately. In fact, that's true. That... Uh, so we have to go on. Uh, with life, we have to go on. So we use what is there. In fact, I, uh, it's like... Uh, it's the same room they sleep. It's the same room they sleep. They, they read in. It's the same room they cook. You can see even Sufriya's there, there are Jikos here. But, uh, man, you know I'm privileged because I never thought this boy could be this humble. Because uh, during our time when you could get such marks and you'd be much the best, even in the village alone, they will know you, man. Uh, one thing I've realized that when he came in the boy was still reading. Other boys, they are now cut walking just around. They are just loitering around showing people that... Them, their schools have grown. Yes, they are showing them that they performed. Yeah. They are in big schools. So, first of all, Julius, congratulations. Thanks. I know the God that uh, made you get a scholarship from primary to secondary. To, from primary to secondary. It's the same God that's going to see you through. So, I wanted just to hear your story. Because uh, I wanted to discover... How did you made it? So maybe you used to read so hard, maybe because you have not talked about how you read. But people who will view this video have seen yeah. what made Julius pass. Yeah. Because if this time Julius is reading, and how many boys have we met out there? How many people are hanging? Them. Even near my shop, how many boys hang there? A lot of them. A lot, a lot of, of them. them. But the reason why Julius pass, even this is a good role model, in fact, to others. So all the juniors, all the youth that will watch this video, I'm very sure you're motivated. This is a boy that performed in Kenya well. And the brother is here. He has learned from him. So Julius, yeah. me, I don't have anything to give you because I did not come here that I will uh, buy your table. I did not come here, but I wanted to hear your story. So about the food, about... But any time I pass here, because I've been passing here and your brother Baraka greets me. I don't know. I don't know how he, we happen to connect. I don't know. But uh, anytime I pass around again and uh, I have something and chip in. Because now I've known your mother. I've known the other siblings of yours. It's a lovely story. So, because the, the bank provide the books, the exercise books, the textbooks, the transport, those things that in the school, whenever you come at home, just use that moment. Maybe you can tell my viewers, what do you want to be when you finish high school? What do you want to be in future? Okay, I want to be a neurosurgeon. A neurosurgeon. Yeah. Do you know that what that person does? Yeah. What does he do? He operates uh, with the veins, muscle on hmm. the head. Wow. Yeah. That's a big dream, man. Eh? Yeah. That's a big dream. So guys that you're watching from Kenya, guys that you're watching from all over this Africa, all over the world, America, UK, China, we have a doctor here, a specialist, a neurosurgeon. And we had the other one in Kibranga. Who was that? My lawyer, Phyllis. Yeah, but no, Phyllis, there's a doctor. The other lady, Susan. Oh, Susan is also a doctor. Yes, yeah. yes. Those people now need to meet because uh, doctor, we can start calling you Dr. Julius. Because once you are a, a doctor, you are a doctor. Dr. Julius. And I'm just praying that God will see you through. God is going to see you through this environment you are living. And one day, apart from making us proud and your viewers proud and even the bank proud, by the way, you have to make your bank proud. 
by the, the bank that I helped, the, the scholarship you got from Equity is the one called Wings to Fly. Mm -hmm. Wings to Fly. One of the best scholarships we have in the country. So make sure you make those people proud. Make sure you make your mother proud. Because if she was here, I would have asked her, how did you feel when your boy was announced? Yeah. Second, how? I'm sure she cried, right? Yeah. I'm sure she cried. Yeah. Were you called to school? No, of course. So parents came and those people, are, teachers are there. The kind of joy that, yes. Second in the nation. It's a moment of crying. Eh? But we thank God, Julius. So I'm sure I've taken your time. I wanted to know your story, the challenges you're going through. You have talked about them. And uh, God will do something. And uh, Juma, yes. don't worry, my brother. Uh, what God has started, nobody can end it. Eh? That's true. So, God has started shining to this family. Wherever your father is, one day he will hear your stories. When he hear that Julius is Dr. Julius, we and you are that. and you are engineer Juma, or what do you want to be yourself? To be, you know, like him. Like him. Yes. So we have two doctors here. In the house. Two doctors. This mother, man, you'll kill him with happiness. You'll kill this woman with happiness because two doctors. We have not asked the Baraka. Maybe you want to imi we want to imitate imitate Barack Obama. We don't know. But we thank God for you people. We thank God that gives you this health. Because sleeping without a mosquito net down here is not a joke. You'll go high. You'll sleep in big hotels. You'll sleep in big houses. So let me say thank you. So people will watch me. People will watch you. They'll comment something. By the way, who said that... Uh, a friend of ours also who said that uh, uh, she bought Baraka, those things. Eh? Yeah. She want also buy the other lady, Mary. Remember Mary? Mary, the young one. As they were wearing, we had Mary and we had Baraka. Oh, yeah. Yes, yeah, Mary. Mary. So she oh, wanted to do the yeah. same to Mary. I, I, I remember her. So, the one that uh, was lacking on the shoes. Eh? Yeah, the one that got shoes was Mary. Yeah. So maybe soon I'll be coming back for Mary. Yeah. But you guys, here we are again. I wanted just to find out about Julius. And uh, we have heard his story. He's a touching story. He's a good story. Yeah. A hardworking boy. And a determined doctor. So all of you, wherever you are, guys, what I can just ask you, pray for Julius. Just prayers is enough. Pray for him that in his academic, in his endeavors in reading, God will give him help. God will give me the ability to grasp whatever he read. So that uh, that dream of becoming a doctor. And I think I'll buy him a book called uh, Think Big and Gifted Hand. Have you ever heard them? Yeah. Yeah, that is Ben Carson. He was a neurosurgeon, right? Yes. The first guy to operate on two twins yeah. that the heads were fixed. Oh, so he thought big, huh? He thought big. That guy, if you read that, if you read that story. And you watch that movie, you just cry. He, that guy is good, Ben Carson. So that should be a role model. Yeah, of course he so, is. From my own promise. Have you ever met those books? I have not gifted, uh, gifted, gifted hands. Have you ever read the Think Big? I'm on the process. You are having it? Yeah, no, no. You but don't? I just borrowed from the school library. Yeah, they are there? Yeah. All right. Maybe we shall get out of uh, Ben Carson's book. Then you read more. That is uh, now your role model as the doctor. So guys... I think I'll have to end my video there because Julius has a touching story that if you explain what he's going through. A person that goes with two meals per day, a low table to read on. If they had a reading problem, especially the light, something has happened. They sleep down with that mosquito nets. I've not asked about the mattress because I don't want to go deeper because God knows. But thank you so much for watching our videos. You can follow me on Instagram. Zach Discoveries, fellow the boy, we are pushing him to 10,000 subscribers. Zach Discovery, 2,000 subscribers above. By the way, you are on also Instagram, eh? Yeah, they can follow me on my Instagram at fellow the boy. On Instagram, uh, at fellow the boy, uh -huh. you can find me there. Uh -huh. uh, follow, to, uh, follow me on my Instagram. Uh -huh. yeah, I have so many inspiring videos, photos, yeah. uh -huh. and, every, and we can also communicate there. All right. Yeah. Thank you so much. Julius? Yeah. Sorry for taking your time. I hope you go back reading. Yeah. Because today you are reading. Yesterday, you, the other day you are reading geography. Today you are reading Christian religious education. Yeah. 
man will be a doctor. I'm just praying for that. Huh? Yes. So we should do something about the lighting system. Whenever I get a shilling, I'll come and deposit. Huh? Yes. And all will be well. So just bye-bye. Yes. Have a lovely My viewers, have a lovely time. Bye-bye. Hello. Bye-bye.